Ford came out swinging with the perfect off-road mid-sized truck, the Ford Ranger Raptor, but the competition isn't staying quiet. Chevy has the all-new Colorado ZR2 Bison. All right, let's break this down. The Chevy Colorado is a mid-sized truck below the Chevy Silverado. It competes in the same segment as the Ford Ranger. The Colorado comes in five different models that include the WT, LT, Trail Boss, ZR1, and ZR2. The ZR2 is the highest trim level built for off-road adventures. It features a 2.7 liter high output engine putting out 310 horsepower and 430 pound-feet of torque. It has a factory three-inch lift with high performance suspension. It rides on 17 inch wheels and 33 inch tires, and it looks really good. So what's a Bison? The ZR2 Bison is a beefed up, no pun intended, ZR2. The 2024 ZR2 Bison gets its exclusive add-ons from a company called AEV or American Expedition Vehicles. AEV is a company that provides OE quality performance driven aftermarket parts and accessories for vehicles geared specifically to off-road and recreational driving like overlanding and trail riding. The Bison receives wider fender flares, a full width steel front bumper with a winch accommodation and rear bumper with steel corner plates. The belly of the beast receives five, count them five, skid plates made of boron steel. The fuel tank and rear differential receive protection as well and a set of steel rock rails are also standard. Now there are only two trucks with Chevrolet that come with a standard set of 35 inch tires the first is the heavy duty Silverado 2500 HD ZR2, and the second is the Colorado Bison. The Bison rides on Goodyear Wrangler Territory Mud Terrain tires, which also include a full size spare. These are bigger than the Ranger Raptor and Toyota Tacoma TRD Pro, riding on 33 inch tires, just like a factory ZR2. Okay, so how do they fit 35s underneath the truck? Secret is that Chevrolet had to modify the Colorado ZR2's front fenders and enlarge the wheel openings, but that's not it. The third gen Colorado's front axle was actually moved forward by 3.1 inches to allow for bigger tires, and that's forward planning from Chevrolet. It has 9.9 .9 inches of front suspension travel and 11.6 inches of rear suspension travel. The suspension is provided by Multimatic and it even has hydraulic front and rear bump stops. The 2.7 liter four cylinder is mated to an eight speed automatic transmission with all wheel drive, electronic locking front and rear differentials. The Bison package does not include any performance upgrades, but the standard ZR2 drivetrain is plenty potent. The ZR2 has five selectable drive modes and one of them is launch control when in Baja mode. The Chevrolet says the launch mode will automatically adjust to different surface conditions such as dirt, sand, or gravel. Now on the interior, it does not get many upgrades from the ZR2 other than AEV branded floor mats and embroidered headrest. The 11.3 touchscreen with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto along with power adjustable seats also come as standard. All right, there's a lot of cool trucks coming out right now. So tell us in the comments below, which is your favorite and which one do you think will be the king of the off-road segment? Will it be the Range Raptor or will it be the Colorado Bison? you want to know more about the Ford Ranger Raptor, definitely check out this video. As always, guys, thanks for watching today's High Gear News. If you like these videos, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, peace out.